So sometimes when I'm just sitting here playing Xbox and, you know, not making a video and I'm not really listening to music, I'm just kind of playing Xbox, I'll sit there and I'll just, you know, listen to people in game chat. Whenever people talk about me in game chat, and this isn't all the time, but most times people do, they always make it sound like it's their virginity that they're talking about. I hear three different people in game chat talking about it like, is this your first time? Yeah, my first time was like three weeks ago. Last time I played with Rania, he went off. He went all the way to 29 and then he hit a bill. I swear, it sounds like they're talking about their virginity. It's, it's the funniest thing to listen to. That's all I can think about whenever they're talking about stuff like that. I basically just popped all their cherries in a free for a lot. So yesterday I made a mistake. I decided to reply to someone that was talking shit, but I didn't reply to him, you know, in a talking shit manner, but it kind of pissed me off a little bit. Someone in Obey, I can't remember what their name was exactly, but they tweeted out saying, I can't believe Bobo got kicked from FaZe. Bobo's still in FaZe, by the way, he's not kicked. And then somebody tweets at me. The first thing he does is reply to that tweet saying, holy fuck, why? And then he tweets at me and says, Rain, you're a fucking idiot. Why would you kick Bobo? He's the fucking best. Are you fucking mental? You fucking retard? Like, so much hate in one tweet. So I'm reading this tweet and I'm thinking to myself, why the fuck did this guy just tweet at me? Like, I'm not even leader. Even if Bobo did get kicked, why are you tweeting at me? Literally, I was the first person he tweeted after reading that tweet. He replied to his tweet saying, what the fuck, really? Or something like that. 30 seconds later, he tweets at me. Why me? And he was talking a lot of shit. I'm just saying to myself, what the fuck did I do? I'm innocent, I swear. Why did I try to knife that guy? I just remembered something. I keep freaking forgetting to click the plus sign. Bang. So I replied to that tweet, but I put the words in front just so people kind of understood it. And I replied saying, for one, he's not kicked. And second, I don't know why you would even tweet at me in the first place. And then he replies saying, lol, my bad. What the fuck happened anyway? So then I reply saying, don't ever tweet at me again. And I was still annoyed with him. And it's not even because of that. Some people argued, dude, he's a fan, this, that, and the other. But I'm thinking to myself, even if you're a fan, even if you're a supporter or a subscriber or whatever you are, you don't tweet at someone saying that. Like, it was like like so little respect in one tweet it was retarded like if i got kicked from phase and you guys are supporters of phase why would you tweet at like seabass or banks or tommy or apex saying you guys are fucking idiots for kicking rain like obviously you know people have good intentions for what they do and you know if you guys had questions like why was rain kicked you know what was rain's reason for being kicked that's one thing but tweeting up saying you guys are fucking idiots you guys are fucking retarded because I got kicked. That's just stupid. Honestly, guys, if I ever get kicked, don't even tweet at Seabass and Tommy and Apex or anybody. Don't don't tweet at the leaders. Just if you want to talk shit to someone, just tweet at Adapt. Talk mad shit to Adapt. Just tweet I'm saying, fuck you, Adapt. Can't believe Rain got kicked. Literally just blow up Adapt's mentions. Just talking shit to him if I ever get kicked. And then I got a bunch of people tweeting at me saying, oh dude, you're a prick for replying to that guy, this, that, and the other. And I'm thinking to myself, like, just damn, I was getting really, really heated with Twitter for some reason. And I don't ever get heated with Twitter. Like, I don't ever get into Twitter arguments. I don't ever do this, that. And the other, I just said that, I don't know why I repeated myself. Dude, I just fucking choked a quad headshot feed kill cam. Seriously, somebody's talking shit, you don't reply to it, you just straight up ignore it. And no, it doesn't make you a pussy for blocking someone or anything. So for the people that had to see me reply to all that stupid shit on Twitter, I apologize for that. I usually don't, and I wasn't even talking shit to anybody, so that's good. But then some people were tweeting at me saying, oh dude, you're cocky, this, that, and the other. I'm like, dude, like, what? Like, what did I even say? People always pull the, you think you're cool because you're in phase card? All the time. All right, guys, I'm gonna go eat dinner now. You think you're better than me because you're in phase, you faggot? Another triple headshot fee, let's go. Oh, it's just crazy that everything I do makes me cocky. I'll tweet about anything cocky. It's really not fair that people in phase aren't allowed to have opinions of being called cocky or something along those lines just because, you know, we're in phase. I can't believe you're in my game. Oh my God. Dude, I think this kid's moaning. Yeah. I just killed you. Dude. Do you guys hear this? Do you guys hear this? This is Call of Duty sex. Like, I think really, really hard about the things that I say on social media and in videos, and I really try not to come off as cocky because I'm not. It hurts the most people call me a fucking prick. I hate being called a prick. And now I know a thousand million of you guys are gonna be like, Rain, you fucking prick. And you're probably not gonna be British, but you're still gonna call me that. Yes, quad feet. Dude, I'm killing it today. Holy heck. Literally, three games, three clips. I got two triple headshot feeds. Okay, here we go. We're gonna finish it off. Come on, boy. Ah! Hit me, baby, one more time. There's that one Britney Spears song. Give me a sign. I don't know why I knew this, but I knew if I sang Britney Spears, I'd hit a shot. I don't know. I just, I don't even know why I went for that. It's, it is Nuketown. You think these kids are gonna give me a reaction? It was really bad. But. Oh my damn, that was like. That doesn't even count as a shot. Like, if I were to single upload a shot like that, I would expect 50,000 dislikes. 
I still love the comments that I got on my I'm so lucky video. It was the vlog that I made for that one guy. And yo, yo, that reminds me. I don't know why I got so excited, but yo, I cannot believe you guys got the guy. I think is it 20,000? I think his video hit 20,000 likes. Like, yo, that made me so happy. Like, I read all the comments on it. And, you know, he got like 15,000 subscribers out of it. And I have never been more happy. Like, oh my god. The fact that I could do something. <gasps> the fact that I could do something like that for someone is fucking. Yeah. See, I don't even have words for it. But I was so happy. I was honestly so happy that you guys, you know, just. Ah, you guys are awesome. So honestly, guys, it's from like the bottom of my heart. It's thank you guys so much. Like, you guys actually don't get like how much that all means to me. I just don't even know what happened here. But it's. This one, I, I fucked up. I don't even, forgive me. But I'm just, I don't know, it's just awesome that, like, you know, I was able to do stuff like that. I thought he was gonna get hate. I was really worried about that. Like, in my vlog, I don't get to tell, but I was really worried that the guy was gonna get hate because of everything. And you guys actually got minimal hate. And I told him on Skype, I was like, dude, like, you might get hate. So you just try to ignore that as much as you can because there is so much positive comments on that. And he was like, yeah, dude, don't worry. And I was like, I was really happy. And then, I don't know, he just got so many likes and so many subscribers and views. And, on something like that, I just, I thought it was awesome that you guys, you know, would do something like that for someone else. And the fact that, you know, I was able to, you know, direct you guys towards him, just, it really, it's, it's like a full, it honestly is like a fulfilling feeling to me. So, just thank you guys one more time so much for everything. But this has been the video. I'm just going to wrap it up right now. If you guys do want to leave a like, that would be awesome. If you can make 10,000 likes, I'd appreciate that very much. I had like three clips in this. I got back to back to back and then I hit that, that new, I'm not going to count that Newtown shot. That was just, I don't even know what to call that. It's been FaZe Rain. You guys have a terrific day.